A lot of folks may not know this, but Tiny Tim's teeth. I like to call it Tiny Tim's tooth. And I said that, you heard me right, tooth. Because, uh, hold on a second. Pick Trudy, baby. This is about Tim. <laughs> no, you don't want a video about Tim. It can only be about Pick Trudy. But we're talking about Tiny Tim's teeth today. And uh, a lot of folks don't know this about Tiny Tim. Excuse me, Ringo. But I want to show you something. And I hope that Ringo will allow me to do this. Tiny Tim has a tooth. <laughs> it's a big tooth. <laughs> Ringo, now, that was the meanest thing. There was no reason for that. I'll holler at you later, Tim. We'll talk more about this tooth of yours. Guys, I know it's tooth. But I think it's cute to say tooth. Ringo, that was not sweet what you did. That was not sweet what you did, my buddy. You got any teeth? Can we see? Can we look at your teeth? People want to see your teeth. <laughs> Let us see your teeth. If you want to make a video about your teeth. Uh-oh. Oh, look at this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, this could really be there. Alright. There you are. Save me, Hawk. Save me, Mr. Hucky. Save Daddy. Oh, you come to save me. Thank you, Hawk. You come to save Daddy. That's what I love. Oh no. <laughs> Ring goes back. Ringo, save daddy. Mr. Huck, come to my rescue. Even the geese won't mess with Ringo. How do you do that? Such presence. How do you have such a presence? Huh? Can I see your tag? Ringo Morrow. I've got lost cr cruising for new women for my harem. Return to Meg. <laughs> Oh, my Lord. That's funny. Yeah, I'm not going to get a video made today. Not what I wanted. Some days it's like that, folks. Some days you're just going to have to just take what you can get and just deal with it. Yeah. Here's our little pot-bellied guy. And he's a sweet little boy. Ringo? Okay, this is not going to work. Do I have to put you on a leash so I can look at Tiny Tim's tooth? Huh? All right, so this video was supposed to be about Tiny Tim. And Ringo's not, okay, here we go. He's eating some corn. Now's our chance to go see Tiny Tim's tooth. Tiny Tim, people want to see that big old tooth of yours. Can we see that big tooth of yours? I want you to lay over on this side. So what I do is, if I love this side of the belly, start loving over on this side he'll flop it over flop it over flop over come on flop it over big boy <laughs> there we go folks don't judge please this is a page where we do not judge all right so here's our focus of today's video tiny tim's big tooth and it is a big one that right there is a little tusk all right so in the elephant kingdom they're called tusk and I guess in other kingdoms of animals are called tusk, but look at that thing. Oh no, Ringo! Tiny Tim is trying to. Sorry, Tim. Ringo, please, buddy. Oh man. Uh, there's so much to say about that tooth, Ringo. A lot of neat things we could talk about with that tooth. But uh, it may just not happen right now. I guess I'll have to come back. We'll talk later, Tim. Sorry. All right, we're gonna try to sneak over here again. Oh my gosh, get away from me. Stop, oh. Okay, okay, enough. Get, get away. Get away. Jeez. Some days it's like that. You don't really get to pick and choose your video material. It just kind of happens, you know? Right, Shirley? Some days videos just sort of happen. Today it just so happens to be Ringo. 
And all I wanted to talk about was Tiny Tim and his tooth. And everything else is messing this up. Right, Mr. Huck? Oh, my Lord. Sir, please. Oh, he just wants love so bad. I'm giving you love, okay? Now, please. <laughs> Hi, Shirley. There's Shirley. Look at our Shirley bird. Okay. All right, we're back for one last shot at this. I left Ringo and the geese way over there. Well, let's see if we can finally get a look at those teeth. So, a lot of folks have seen that little tooth, and I just have never been so shocked at how good people's eyes are. You notice everything. So, they've asked if we're going to have that taken care of. And no, we're not, because you already know that pigs in the wild have those tusks like that, and I'm sure there has to be a reason that his tooth is like that. It's not like some kind of something that's messed up or ingrown. I actually believe that a lot of people have those teeth removed when pigs are babies. If they're gonna be a pet or like a show pig, they'll actually have those teeth removed. And, uh, you know, we didn't get Tim as a baby. We got him as a little guy, but he was uh, uh, given to us from a family that just could not take, oh my Lord. <laughs> Look out, Tim. Don't you do that. Don't you do it. You're right. All right, so I had to uh, get away from the animals for a little bit. Uh, I wasn't able to make this video, and I'm sorry you had to wait so long to hear the reason behind Tim's tooth. His teeth. His tusk. Anyway, so pigs are born with these tusks, folks. Now, I can't say if all pigs have them or not, but I know for a fact that uh, the... Uh, like the boar hogs, the javelinas, and then even the little pot bellies pigs, they're born with, the, with these tusks, and uh, they protrude out of their mouth for a purpose. They actually use those to help root around in the ground. You know, that's how they forage for food. They root, they literally, they call that rooting. They root up things that they eat out of the ground, grub worms, uh, actual roots. And uh, so no, there's a purpose behind it. A lot of times that you don't see that in pigs is because uh, when a pig is born, if that person is going to raise that pig as a pet, they can take them to the vet and the vet will actually remove those little teeth, those tusks, so they can't grow. But uh, there's a purpose behind them. So the other reason that uh, they have these tusks, you know, is to defend themselves, to uh, fight off predators. And if you think about it in the wild, if you were a predator and you were looking for an easy meal, even though that pig may seem, uh, would feed the whole family, for a couple of days probably, it would be pretty tough to go up against one knowing how tough they are. And of course, when you can see those tusks, and if, of course, if one bites into you, that would not feel good. That would, that would not be pretty at all. So, all right, well, now you know a little bit more about pig's teeth or Tim's tooth, as I'm calling this video.